Hey guys, Matt with Atlas Precision Consulting. Uh, in this video, we're gonna do a quick tutorial on how to show you how to save your own user configurations uh, when you're in things like search windows. Uh, in this example, we're gonna jump into the order number um, lookup. So you're probably very familiar with these screens. You can actually uh, cater these to your own um, uses. Uh, just a quick example is you can right click on here you can go to the column chooser and say, I don't care about source ID. I don't care about this. You know, you pick whichever ones that work for you. You click okay. It's gonna remove those. Uh, if you always want the order number to be first, you could just click and drag it over here. If you want the customer name to be next, you can do that. Um, and then you can even these settings up here, the contains and the searchable columns are also part of your use configuration. To save it, you just simply right click and hit save user configuration. When we come back in here, it's gonna be the exact same search that we had. Um, now there's a couple other things you can do with that that makes it useful for you to do your job. Um, if you are somebody that's only concerned about orders from your location, you can actually save filters within um, the search window. So every time you come into it, it just defaults. It's very useful for when you're doing PO receipts and you want to make sure that you're only focusing on your location. You can save it if you're looking up a PO for some reason. But in the example, I can type in location 10. I can hit the save user configuration. And every time I come back in here now, it's gonna have uh, that filter saved. Now you'll notice there's a little bit of a bug here. You can see that it's filtered. It doesn't show the 10 until um, I click on it. Uh, but now any searching I do in here was only going to filter out for location 10. Now, if you mess all this up and, and, and you wanna start over, you simply just right click hit clear user configuration, exit the window, and when you come back in, it's gonna be the exact same window it was before you started doing all your editing. One other little tip I wanna do while we're in here, you can also see this drag uh, column header. You could come in here and say, you know what, I always wanna look at my sales orders by my customer's name. We can save that user configuration. We're gonna go back in here and I'm just gonna search all that's in here. And you can see that it breaks down the orders uh, by customer name. And you can also do more filters and, and more things like that in there. So just get in there and play around with it. And again, you're only affecting yourself. You're not affecting anybody else. Um, make sure you guys like and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments about this video or other videos you wanna see, put a comment below. Um, and as always, Atlas is here for your Profit 21 needs. Have a great day, guys.